Does this bring you down memory lane? Oh, you spare no that. expense. Thank you, Gina. Gina. We'll do yes. it all. We'll do. You know, Diane Sawyer and I, we called ourselves Thelma and Louise. I heard Who was who? Uh, I, she gets top billing. So okay. she, she, she was Thelma. Thelma. Yeah, top billing there. But can you believe 25 years no, later? What, no. what is it about that film that still resonates with folks, Susan? I don't know. Maybe don't, you know, you are what you settle for. And I think it's a very romantic, right? I mean, it's yeah. kind of a romanticized yeah. road trip movie. Well, but then right. because it was us, it ended up being something more significant. The ending really... Um, caused quite a reaction when you guys were in here. So for those people who don't remember, here's a reminder. What do you think about the ending, about going over the cliff? Well, ending I that mean, way? for me, I, that's the first thing I said is after you test this, are you going to change it and they're both going to be a club med or something? What's going to happen? And, yeah. and he said, I know you will definitely die. I'm not sure about her. He said, and then by the I end we had kind of, <laughs> and by the end we had kind of earned the right for both of us to go over. He said, you might push her out at the last minute, but uh, actually Ooh. it ended up. We only had like one take too. It yes. was, they shot the helicopters all day long, and Harvey, and then as the sun was coming down, we had like one take. Let's let's, let's equal time. Let's talk a little bit about the guys in the film. Brad Pitt. That was the first time many of us were like, oh. <laughs> who, 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 who is this? Who yeah. is this? And uh, was it true that uh, George Clooney didn't even realize that he oh, read for the part? You know, uh, this is. Did I tell you this? That uh, uh, I was on a plane next to George Clooney by happenstance, and, and we're chatting, and he says, "You know, I hate that Brad Pitt." I said, "No, you don't. He's your friend." He said, "No, I hate him because he got the part in Thumb of the Week. And I said, "Oh, were you interested in that part?" He's like, "Well, couldn't you tell when I read with you?" And oh, I know. I know. I know. Girl. I know. Whoa. But uh, I'm telling when you know I read. I remembered when I didn't read with him. <laughs> that's, that's what you do. That's what you remember. I would know that. Uh, oh. oh my God! What did you say? I said, oh, I'll do a movie with you now. No, I, that was, that was a good I didn't response. admit it, but now I'm admitting it. Hello. Yeah. Everybody thought, okay, this is going to change the landscape for women in Hollywood. Right. Didn't happen, and I know, Gina, you've been doing a lot of work with that, with your institute in, in studying that. Every few years, there's a movie that comes out that does well, and people say, well, now everything's changed. Now it's all changed, just like Thelma Louise, and, and it really hasn't. There's been no movement in the needle since 1946. And because uh, you all are all involved in other projects, saw the meddler. <gasps> oh my goodness, saw it! I uh, love the accent. First of all, the joy's the accent. Uh, you nailed it. Oh no, oh, I know she really does. But yeah. it's with, and you really live up. You take that name of the movie to heart. You meddle in everybody, not just your child's life, but everybody's yeah. life. Anyone with a mom should find this funny. I, I wanted to ask you, do you do? You, are you that in your children's lives? Yeah, yeah, that's my job. Embarrass them, meddle in their lives. Absolutely. <laughs> But it, I mean, it, it could be called good intentions. It's not just, it's all good things. It's not bad things. I'm telling you, Susan's film, The Meddler, is a hoot. It's in theaters right now. I could have talked with them all morning long. 25 years. Where's the time go, guys? I know. Back it's hard to believe. Mm -hmm. Robin, thank you so much. Yeah.